Not yet, Greg, and that's why they posted those pictures you just saw on social media, hoping someone will recognize the suspects and give police a call. At CNP Beauty Supply on Lamar Avenue, an ugly turn of events Tuesday evening. Police say these three people grabbed roughly $500 worth of clothing and ran out of the store without paying. It's very petty. Investigators say the shop's owners chased them into the parking lot and tried to get the items back but failed and were assaulted in the process. Police say one of the owners was punched in the face four times, the other bitten by one of the suspects. I think that's really sad. Bobby Bowen runs a neighboring clothing store. She says she's seen one of CNP's owners try to stop a shoplifter before. I just saw him tussling with somebody that had taken some merchandise, obviously, and they were trying to get to their car, and he was trying to keep them, you know, from getting away. She's not sure if that thief got away, but police say these three suspects did, speeding off in a white Chevy sedan. You can go get your job, work, and, and you can get the things that you want. You don't have to go and take, rob and take, and then you're going to end up going to jail. Jail is where investigators want to see these suspects, posting pictures of them on social media. I think yeah, anybody that's walking around taking things that don't belong to them, they, they should definitely be caught. They need to be stopped. Something Bowen wouldn't want to take on herself. Well, you don't know if they got a gun, a knife, or you don't know who in a car that the, the person is, the getaway person that's driving. So, no, I, I wouldn't approach that. Thankfully, at her shop. Never had any problems in here at all. Knock on wood. <laughs> Yeah, knock on wood indeed. Now, sadly, police say the suspects also stole one of the store owner's phones. We did leave a message for those owners at the shop today, but we haven't heard back. Live downtown, Andrew Ellison, WRG News, Channel 3.